hello y'all welcome back um so i went and a little bit of grinding off screen as far as like cheating getting xp so this current character that i have roland the new file that i had uh so i've been playing for about what looks like roughly two hours and i'm at level 40 right now mainly because i've just been cheating my way to level 40 and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna be doing a bunch of side quests and side missions just a bunch of fun, you know, fun little things. A bunch of fun, happy-go-lucky, you know, not not important story side missions. Clearly, clearly not story side missions. Those ones we can save till later. We can save till it gets a little spicy. But yeah, we're level 40 and we're going to be selling off all the things that we don't want anymore. So we have... In our inventory, we don't want those anymore because these are low levels. We can equip this to here now. So we got a legendary on there. So this will get tossed away. And then wherever my rifle was that I had, this one, we'll equip, uh, we'll equip it up there. And we have room for a class mod and a grenade mod. And we'll put on a new shield. Toss the old shield out, toss out these things. And then we have a revolver, a sniper rifle, and an SMG to work with in the future. And then this is the first time we've attached a class mod, so that's just telling us what we have. Sell all of our stuff that we don't want. Yep, there we go. So we have a few missions that we can get done right now, but I think what we'll do is we're just gonna, we'll add on some of our skill points that we have. So we got this one. We're gonna increase this one completely. We don't need this because we don't have teammates, but we can increase these ones. So we don't have any friends. Okay, so this entire, this here, this is, we want that there. So we got good chunk there, ammo regeneration. We don't necessarily need that because we have team regeneration. So now we have a whole, whole chunk of upgrades. We are level 40, so we're probably not gonna see uh, any more increases we can reset our upgrades that we've put on Roland but we're probably not going to be doing that just because I mean why would we so that's a story both of these are, both of these are story missions I think what we'll do because I think maybe this one's a little easier to perform uh, we can get a bunch of side missions from there so let's go meet TK Baja I wonder how much damage I actually do All right, so our current objective is to find some stolen food for Mr. Baja. Oh, oh that's number three. Jeez, I am just one-shotting everything, even my knife. Or at least I'm one-shotting the level twos here. I can guarantee if I get up to level four and whatnot, I'm probably going to have to use more than just one shot. Boom. All right, so now those are dead. Let's just move on with our mission. So I think what we'll try to do is we'll complete five missions, and that'll do it for this episode. The first one, meeting TK Baja, doesn't necessarily count. So we'll count this one as our first mission. This is essentially, I think, a tutorial on just the basics of the game. So it's not necessarily teaching you where to go and whatnot. It's just teaching you the sort of mechanics and the things of the game. So it's telling you, you can buy grenades and you can buy all sorts of stuff. There are these little dispensing stuffs here. And I think that, toss a grenade, toss a grenade, boom, boom. Oh man, I love I love these grenades. These are legitimately my favorite. They will go out of their way to try to seek out targets and they'll break up into pieces so that they can steal health for you. I wonder how much money I have. Ooh, I'd like to buy the upgrades. All right, back to TK Baja. That's a level three bandit. Ooh, one shot, boom, death. All right, back to TK Baja. All right, so we completed that mission. Uh, this is our. This is gonna be one of the first missions that we have that we go out of this current loaded area. We're gonna go find Nine Toes, whoever he is, and we're gonna have to kill him. All right. So I think this is mission number three. We are blasting through these missions. I don't typically know how long these are supposed to take, but we are just blasting through these missions. All right, and we're heading into Skag Gully. Don't need to pay attention to the other vending machines there, just gotta keep going. I'm interested to find out when I'm gonna stop becoming such an OP, you know, character right now. I wanna know at, to at what point 
I eventually have to fight something that doesn't immediately die in two shots. Like right there. I took two shots, but it died in one. We got something horrible and then something even worse. All right. I wonder if I can... Yep, I can one-shot knife these guys. Now that wasn't so bad. Yeah, these guys ain't gonna be much. I wonder if I can knife them. Yes, I can 100% knife, 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 knife. I actually very rarely ever use the knifing feature in this game just because it's not optimal as far as when I try to play. I usually just run and gun, run and gun. That's my method. Can I skip this cutscene? No, I can't. All right, so I think what I'll do is I'll just toss that and then see. Yep, that went as well as I thought it'd go. Can I collapse you? I don't think so. I'm pretty sure he was supposed to have dogs come out. I wonder where they, what happened to them. All right. Well, that was nine toes. He was supposed to have dogs. I don't know where they went. I guess they died too early. All right, let's get out of here. I just I think I just realized something. I um, as I'm firing my gu as I was firing my gun, I ultimately realized that I think as far as my rate of fire goes, it's impossible for me to run out of bullets. The class mod that I have, well, it's not impossible for me to run out of bullets, kind of, but the class mod that I have, it's it's it like essentially gives me as much ammo as I'd ever need ever. Like I'm I don't think I'm gonna run out anytime soon. The cla this class mod that I have is it's so cool. I essentially have infinite ammo so long as I don't shoot faster than it can replenish. So that's nice to think about. Anyways, we're going to head back to TK Baja to turn this in. And then that'll be end of mission three. We've got two more after that. And then that'll be the end of this episode. Hey, what's up, Baja? What you got? Thanks. All right, what do I do now? You want me to go to Zed? Whatever you say, big man. Oh my wamo, shinderu, bang bang. Ah, uh, if I could kill you, I'd fucking kill you. Whoop. Hey Zed, you job hunting, turn that in. Heck yeah. Yes, I know how to visit my active missions, please. Scooter, the scooter, the Alabama boy. All right, going back to TK Baja, scooter's talking in my ear, but you know, it's fine. We're just gonna head back to TK Baja. We're gonna see what the situation is. We're gonna go and take him to the gun. Go there, good damn. Hello, Mr. Baja. All right. I would consider this to be mission number four. We are going to kill a skag named Scar and we are going to recover Mr. Baja's leg. This is gonna be fun. And you know what? I appreciate y'all coming on to me with this adventure, you know, hanging around. Gonna have a jolly old time. I think uh, this skag may be my first challenge. Everything else I've been one-shotting so far, so I'm thinking this one may take more than five bullets. Now, where is it? It's over on that end. Ooh, level eight. I wonder. Nope. Still not a challenge. <sighs> How disappointing. If you want to beat me, you'll have to train for another hundred years. Bah, bah. I have no time for bah, 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 bah. And this is all with a regular old pistol. Wonder what would happen if I used my stronger weapon. Because this isn't even my strongest weapon. This only does 122 damage. This one does 357. So if I switch it out for this one, I wonder how much damage. And it sets him on fire. And it sets him on fire. Ooh, bang, bang. Okay, so clearly the revolver is not the way to go because I've been. I was doing way bigger damage with my regular pistol. So let's just switch back to that. Yeah, like 295, two, whatever, 295, 295, 295. I was doing way bigger damage with my first one. Is this even the right way to go? I don't even know. Oh, hey, look. I can't remember if this is the right way to go. Get off, get off. When I first played this game uh, for the first time, it was tr it was truly terrifying. Like, I almost died multiple times while trying to play. And now that I know how to cheat in this game and I know how to, like, cheat the system, I guess... This just become uh, this just becomes so so much easier. Like I feel unstoppable, and I'm pretty sure I am, just as so long as I don't die. Pretty sure I went the wrong way, and not good, but I can sell. Not good, but I can sell. Worse, but I could sell. Yep, I went the complete wrong direction. Pretty sure. Okay, I'm a little I'm a little turned around right now. Stop falling. No. Down, doggy. Down, down. Boom. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way this time. Still not a hundred percent, but I'm pretty sure. 
and I hate racks. I hate, f I hate flying characters and enemies in video games. They fucking suck ass. How are you already damaged? What? Yeah, you took a little. Mo no. Oh, it almost fell. Okay, you took a little. M you took a couple more bullets to take down, but you know that's that's all right. That's all right. It wasn't that many, but you know you took took more than one at least. So you did good, buddy. You did. You all. You did good. Oh, you, just, you did pretty good. Okay. I can't say that you stacked up against anybody or anything else, but you did. Did better than the. Than the rest. All right. My work here is done. Time to head back to Mr. Baja. Following me. Die. 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 All right. After we turn this in, that's gonna be mission number four, and after that, one more mission, and. That'll be the end of the episode. I know I keep saying that a lot, but I just want to remind myself because sometimes I can genuinely get carried away in this game. And I mean, compared to Borderlands 2 and 3, this uh, this one is a lot slower. Like, it's definitely... Or it's this one is definitely a lot um, shorter of a story. So it's easy to... It's, a, it's pretty easy to finish off. And then this is a part of the tutorial, so I'll consider this not a, a mission i'm just trying to make excuses so i can keep playing but this is part of the tutorial so i won't consider this a actual mission but this will actually be our last mission of this episode this is where we fight the big baddie bonehead and then get the module back so we can get a catch ride but they do little to no damage to me and I can kill that one with one shot. I'm sure there's brutes. I'm supposed to give some brutes. You bonehead? No, you're a burning psycho. Where are the brutes? I want to see what the brutes do. I want to see how fast I take them down. Damn nah, my a shield. Oh no, a shield. Stay away. Where are the brutes? I'm sure if he gets me down to my health, then I'll be in trouble. But um, he didn't. So sell that, and then you got nothing else worthwhile. What's in the what's in the box? What's in the box? The module, the module that I needed. Thank you. Now I leave before I get into any more trouble. With how powerful I am, I am definitely going to become overly confident with my abilities. And then I'm going and then I'm going to try to go up against like a level 20 and I'm be like, "Haha, you can't kill me." But then suddenly I I have no shield on and my bullets do jack shit and then I die. And then that's how that's going to happen. And that's, that's just going to be life. My overconfident cocky ass is going to fucking get the better of me. But that's it. If we've killed Bonehead, I would consider that mission successful. In any case, I think that, uh, that's where I'm going to leave it off for tonight. Uh, kind of tired, but I could keep playing this game all night, honestly. Uh, yeah, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Picked up a couple new missions just before I decided to turn this off. In any case, that is what it's going to be. And that's where the episode's going to end. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Borderlands. Um, not too many more to come because I am, like, the worst at playing video games. I am absolutely, like, horrific. I can't play video. I can't play video games in an entertaining way to save my life i am so completely boring and my commentary is reflective of that so you know bandit thug take it away